Hello YouTube, we're putting the back fenders on. So I got that big horse on the outside because it's going to pivot here then against this metal. I have these bolts so tight this thing will stay open on its own. Because it's kind of hard to lift up with one hand for me. It does get heavy with the seat on it. Okay, let me swing you to the front here. See this bracket? Okay, now let me go up here. See that how I how that's spacered? And I spaced it more than they, someone else had it. They had a washer and that nut on there. That's to make this go back because it was too far ahead. You can't bolt it right to the fender. So I think you see what I mean. I'll try to get a picture when I close it down. Okay, can you see up in there? And these fenders are kind of sprung, but once you set on it, it goes down. The other side I did a little repair. The rubber was gone. You see what I mean? It's, it's not exact, but it'll work. In case somebody has one of these runs in the pump, I swear this this could be fenders off a different year or something. But there you go. Well, the camera can fit up underneath here. Okay, let's put the seat on, then we'll be done. We don't want this to be a long video. Okay, we got the seat bolted on with some washers on it. And we did fidget worm. We fixed that other piece right up there it's because the bolt will not was catching okay fenders on seats on i'm going in it's not that it's that hot out it's probably only like low 80s but the humidity is a choker it's like 60 some dew point but there you go one thing left the paint is the hood we'll snap a couple photos of this and thanks for watching